night. It's uh, Monday. It was a horrible day yesterday. The power went out at 2.30 in the morning and didn't come back on until uh, about, oh, about 14 hours later. And uh, I've got a photograph here of why it went out. <laughs> We had such high winds that it took out a couple of uh, power poles. And, uh, well, you got to give props to those uh, people who go out in the weather. It was at least three degrees with the windshield factor yesterday. And they were out there in the wind and the cold repairing those two towers. And I'm telling you, Without them, I mean, you just don't realize how much you rely on electricity until you lose it. So, anyway, that's my thought for the day. Thank goodness for the electric company. Sometimes we aren't too happy with them, but yesterday was a good day for them. All right, I'm going to be uh, working on his upper part of his body. And uh, it's not going to take long. I've got uh, people coming. I've got uh, people want to take me to dinner. I got all kinds of things going on. And uh, just going to have to play it by ear all afternoon. Time to play with some clay. His muscles are relaxed, uh, so I'm going to take down a little bit of the stress in the muscles. Yeah, 14 hours without power, that uh, really makes you stop and think how dependent we are on modern necessities. All right, I've been uh, working on the uh, skin with the uh, lighter fluid and the sponge. I didn't show a lot of that because quite honestly, it's like about as boring as watching water fall off a duck's back. But uh, the next thing I'm going to do is start working on his hair texture. And I've got a couple people here right now, so I can't uh, video it, but I'll show it later. All right. Be right back. All right. I'm just going to put a little bit of texture. I'm not going to overdo it. I want to keep it plain because the more texture you put into it, the more they have to clean it when it comes out of the uh, ceramic mold. And the more they have to clean, 
adds hours to your casting costs and uh, your time is very expensive when it's coming to cleaning a, a bronze and getting it ready to be patina because if any of the investment material is left in the, the bronze it'll come out like a white spot when they color the uh, bronze with its uh, acid patina all right that's going to be it for today and i'll pick this up uh, probably tomorrow um, i'm going to probably be taking this to the foundry in a couple of days um, it depends on the weather and the roads because it's about 60 miles to the foundry and uh I'm just not really all that enthused about driving in the snow. All right. Good night, everybody. Have a great night, and I'll see you next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.